and put your hands there until you aim and get the trigger. Okay, extend fully. Now we're gonna do something a little different now. With this thumb, okay, keep, extend fully. Okay, aim at the target. With this thumb, I want you to pull the hammer back. With this thumb? Yeah, with that thumb, yeah. Pull the hammer, you can, you can loosen up for a second. Okay. Pull the hammer back, keep your finger off the trigger, all the way back, lock it back. Now put your thumb back on the side. Now, the trigger pull is gonna be a lot easier now. So I want you to aim mm. at that tar target over there. Don't bounce the gun up and down, mm -hmm. okay? Aim, put it on your and then gently squeeze the trigger. It's gonna be a much easier trigger pull now. Okay, you can do it again. Finger off the trigger. You see how much easier? Yeah. So for target shooting, this is preferable. For defensive shooting, you want a harder trigger pull, and I'll explain to you why in a second. Okay. There you go, good. Were you aiming for that one? No. Because if you hit the one all the way in the back. No, that was by accident. Okay. Okay, line it up, put it right into target, and very gently squeeze. Are you aiming for the first red one? I was aiming for that first Because you're way one. high. Make sure you're doing this, not that. Okay. This. This has to plug in that hole and nothing should st stick over the top. Okay. You put that underneath the spot you want to hit. Okay. And line it up. Let's go back to the cans. Come back over here to the cans. Over the can. You're aiming for that golden can right there, mm -hmm. right? Okay, line it up, put it underneath the can. The can should be sitting on top of your sights. Okay, okay. do it again. I don't know if the gun's out yet. six. All right, do one more time just to be sure. Now aim. Watch your sights. Okay, now you see how, how you jerked it? Mm -hmm. You don't want that. Okay. okay you, want, I mean, you want to be able to... Oh, sorry. Mm -hmm. Watch my hand as I pull the trigger, right? Keep you had a gun still. barely moving? Yeah. Let me see you do that exercise. <sighs> straight finger. Straight finger. Left finger's always straight. Press your thumbs. Close this gap here. There you go. Press your thumbs. Extend fully. Aim at a can or any target out there. doesn't matter. Now I want you to practice aiming that trigger or pressing that trigger without moving the gun. Okay. You see your sights moving? Mm -hmm. So you need practice. I think it's I'm just nervous. Maybe that's why. No, no. <laughs> this is all new shooters go through this. Keep doing that. Try to get it so the gun doesn't move so much. Okay, good. Now you can give me the gun for a second. I'm gonna do a drill with you now, a different drill. Okay. Okay. We have uh, one live round, right? I'm gonna stick it in there. You have no idea where that live round is. <laughs> okay? Okay, the idea here is that, see, every time you shoot, you want the gun to surprise you. Mm -hmm. You don't want to anticipate when the gun's gonna go off. Mm -hmm. So I want you to treat every every time you squeeze the trigger, I want you to just assume that it's, a, it's an empty round. Okay? But, but, it's, but it's a dummy round. Okay. Okay? Go ahead. There you go, press your thumbs, full extension. Pull the hammer no, back. no, just, just shoot it. Okay. Yeah, straight finger. Go ahead, extend fully. Pick a target over there. Concentrate on not making those sights move. Okay, don't jerk the gun around. Press it back gently, like the brake pedal of your car. There you go, keep aiming. Try not to get the gun to move. Okay, okay the gun's empty now. Now we know the gun's hey, empty. <laughs> no, I'm telling you, a revolver makes way more sense for, for personal defense. This, I mean, 16 rounds is nice, but um, it's like, it's just, it, you know, it, it, and then as for clearing the barrel, I mean, you some people could do it really, really quickly, mm -hmm. but, um, you know, a revolver really makes more sense for personal defense. Go ahead, run up the sights, aim, pick up that slack, and zero.
Friend. Straight back. Don't bounce the gun. Just keep aiming. Press it straight back. Keep aiming even after you press the trigger. Go ahead. The red target. Keep aiming. Slowly press. Put your finger on the trigger. Pick up the slack. There's a little bit of play on it. Pick up that play and then find out where it's about to break and then press it. Okay, so it just happens. Okay, let's see. Oh, it's around the chamber. I don't think you're pressing it hard enough. Oh, okay. Yeah, let go for a second. Let me show you. Uh -huh. 